Hey everybody, I wanted to make this because one of my previous playthroughs, I completely missed the twist with Jennifer and Karen Moran. If you are romancing her, you may want to see this video. So right now you're finishing the final trial with Lambert. I always like to stop by inside the castle and say hello to him. Try to get him into a nice guy because he's getting ready to meet Kira Metz, who's going to be his new girlfriend. If you did save her at the fight tower. And you're going to find him near the big fire. Also, you notice me walking around the bottom floor. You want to loot everything in Care Morin. Everything. Loot every single box you can find. Can we talk? What about? So what you want to do, you want to take the nice selection while you're speaking to him. You can always pick on Lambert. He's got that kind of attitude. Now from here, you're going to go upstairs and you're going to talk to Jennifer. So what you want to do is follow the parts of the conversation on the nice side and get it kick-started into her in the right mood for when you start the next mission quest, excuse me, you'll be have her in the right mood for a tryst. See you later. Geralt? Ever think about the past? About your time with the hunt? At times, I'm amazed we survived. Eridan's not usually one to leave witnesses behind. That's just it. He didn't. Lost my memory when I escaped the hunt. Ah, oh, yes. Your famous amnesia. You didn't have it? For a short time only. Once the Emperor's mages got their hands on me, my memory quickly returned. When the hunt had you, hope they didn't hurt you. Even if they did, I've no memory of it. The whole time's but a string of phantom images. Blood and fire. A wild chase through different worlds. All shrouded in fog. Though I do remember you coming for me. Trading your life for mine. I hadn't the chance to thank you then. You'd have done the same for me. I'm touched by your certainty. But you've yet to tell me how you escaped them. Wouldn't mind knowing that myself. There are times I remember rushing forward, red riders around me. Next thing I know, I'm in the woods at the foot of Kaer Morin. That's it. What did Aridin want from you, exactly? The same thing he wanted from you. You don't recall? Draw a blank on most of my time with them. We were bait, Geralt. Both of us. Aridin believed Ciri would come for us sooner or later, and he would capture her. Fortunately, she didn't fall for it. How do you go from being the Emperor's hostage to being his ally? One day, the door of my cell opened, and instead of seeing the usual officer, I saw Emir. He promised to release me and grant me free reign of the Imperial Treasury, provided I did what he asked. He told you about Ciri, and you accepted his offer. Why? Shared aims make for strange bedfellows. I knew I had to find Ciri before Eridan did. And if any man had the power and the means to help me, it was the Emperor. Besides, once all said and done, he is her father. Why didn't you look for me after you'd recovered your memory and your freedom? I assumed you would recover quickly and find me first. You had mages to help you. I was on my own. Well, not entirely. Besides, I knew you'd fled the hunt. Eridan would never have let you go. He'd erased my memory, but you escaped. It was wholly possible he hadn't had the chance with you. And there were your Witcher mutations. I expected they'd stave off any serious injury. Still can't get something out of my mind. What? So... Feel any different after our encounter with the Jinn? Yes. Now I feel... regret. Mean to say that... That I regret we didn't try that earlier. Much earlier. Think we would have 
argued less. Quite the opposite. But the other moments would have been more intense as well. Moments like this. <laughs>